Support Infusion Blend. You will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great-tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. The globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency. Super Male Vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals. Super Male Vitality by InfoWars Life is so powerful that I only take half the recommended dose. For a limited time, we are offering 15% off Super Male Vitality at InfoWarsLife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today to secure your Super Male Vitality. InfoWarsLife.com a chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average, the county says it sprays with the glyphosate at least once a week. Few filters cut out the glyphosate that is found in water supply supplies worldwide. Remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, hydrofluorosilicic acid, sodium hexafluorosilicate. Fluoride, it is in tea, it's in coffee, it's in water, it's in bread, it's in toothpaste. It is our responsibility to protect our families. The establishment's not going to do it. It's time to take action. It's time to filter our water. Visit InfoWarsStore.com and use promo code WATER to get 10% off their entire family of incredible products. Or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. Coast to coast. Direct from Austin, you're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Defending the Republic from enemies, foreign and domestic, it's Alex Jones. And first, Western powers have warned Moscow faces further sanctions over the worsening Ukraine crisis amid fears of an imminent Russian invasion. Now, negotiators are still trying to secure the release of a group of international observers seized by pro-Russian militia in the country's east as Ukraine's forces continue to wage an offensive against the rebels in the region. A Ukraine's interim prime minister has called on Moscow to pull back its forces after accusations Russian jets are violating Ukraine's airspace. There is only one reason for these Russian aircraft to be violating Ukrainian airspace and that's to conduct reconnaissance missions. There is an added urgency to Ukraine's Prime Minister's trip to drum up support for sanctions against Russia in Europe. We urge Russia to pull back its security forces, not to provoke and not to support Russian lead terrorists that are located and deployed in eastern and southern Ukraine. Eight foreign OSCE right, military that's enough. observers and five... I wanted you to hear the part where they talked about imminent invasion. So, any Russians that have always been living in Ukraine, basically been part of Russia forever, who don't want to be enslaved by the new overthrow government that overthrew, they weren't elected, is a terrorist. But 
this very prime minister's people a month and a half ago were burning buildings and blowing stuff up, being called freedom fighters by our media. The same media that demonizes the family and the Second Amendment and private property rights. The same globalist media. I just want to point that out, that the Russians say that if they continue to invade these predominantly Russian cities, ethnically Russian, and start and continue killing people, and they're doing it every day at checkpoints, that the Russian military is going to invade uh, that country. And I'm not saying that's a good thing. The point is, is that that's what they're going to do. Because 93% of Ukraine just got taken over by NATO and the EU in the overthrow government. Russia's grabbed about 7% of the country on their border that has their military bases and their pipelines, their gas pipelines and oil pipelines. The, the Russian infrastructure that supplies much of Europe's uh, petro uh, energy. Russia has had a very measured response, in my view, geopolitically to this. Because they don't want to have a war with the West, a war that will cripple them just like the war in Afghanistan for 10 years that was also staged by the West. Now, back then, the Soviet Union was very corrupt, very oppressive. Their political system was very evil. But still, I think it was immoral to use al-Qaeda from 1979 on. It, Reagan didn't start it, he just took credit for it, which is fine. Jimmy Carter and Zbigniew Brzezinski started it, that's declassified, using al-Qaeda to attack not just Russian bases in in. Afghanistan, but Russian bases in surrounding countries. So the Russians poured in to deal with that threat, just like they've been fighting Western back to Al Qaeda uh, in areas like Chechnya. And, and the CIA, on record, funds radical Islam and Al Qaeda all over Russia. Just like they fund Al Qaeda to attack Syria, Libya, and Egypt. And when our former ally wouldn't go along with turning the country over to Al Qaeda, Hazi Mubarak, they arrested him. So I just want to point out you got criminal banking interest above America and Europe using Al Qaeda, using the radical extreme Nazis uh, that are the minority in the Ukraine. Ukraine's great folks in Western Ukraine, mainly Catholic. But the, but the, the government is a ultra nationalistic, so right wing they're socialist. They go all around the political spectrum. They actually haul Hitler at their meetings. I mean, this is so bizarre for me to, that if you say something mildly what they claim is racist, they will demonize you in the controlled media with political correctness. But then you've got the Ukrainian uh, government where the deputy prime minister is in videos in a three-piece suit hailing Hitler. I mean, that's who this political party is. Ukraine was Nazi during World War II, for those that didn't know. And so they're Nazi again, and it is just unbelievable, unbelievable that that they then put out a story two weeks ago that, oh, my gosh, synagogues, you know, there's there's list of saying Jews get out of eastern Ukraine. The Russians say the Russians aren't persecuting any Jews. It's Western Ukraine that's doing that. But see, when it comes out that Western Ukraine is anti-Semitic, a lot of them, a large minority are, you just spin it and say, oh, no, that's Russia. And they know the average American isn't paying attention. So I want to hear from you on this front. We're going to take calls the rest of the hour. Then I'm going to get into, because this is an example of mind control, an example of how political correctness is the new religion in this country. While we're all being discriminated against, black, white, Hispanic, old, young, Asian, I don't care, by General Electric running the White House uh, Energy Council and uh, Developmental uh, Economic Council, they're exempt from the rules Obama put in four years ago that have shut down now more than 500 power plants in the country. Clean burning coal plants that supplied 52% of our power, now they supply about 31%. And when that gets down to about 10%, which they project in the next few years, you're going to have more than a doubling in your prices on average. But U.S. electricity prices may be going up for good. L.A. Times. Experts warn of growing fragility as coal plants are shut down, nuclear power is reduced, and consumers switch to renewable energy. Now, again, China gets three new plants a week. Mexico gets a new one every few weeks. Our jobs are all moving there because they have cheap energy. You cut off the energy, you cut off the country. That's a simple equation. There's no gas in your car, you don't go to work. There's no food in your tummy, 
you get a stomach ache and start losing calories. You cut your leg off, you bleed to death, there's your oxygen energy, you die. Don't get a tourniquet on it. This country's legs cut off, blood is spraying like fire hoses out of it. And this is discriminating against all of us under Agenda 21 and the UN Treaty to shut America down. Cloward and Piven. Look it up. This is a plan. Obamacare is meant to shut the country down. That's what's discriminating against us, but that doesn't matter. Obama, Sharpton, Magic Johnson. So Obama, the fast and furious criminal, Sharpton, the FBI cocaine dealing rat, and Magic Johnson gang up on NBA owner Sterling. You know, I think what Sterling said, he's being instigated to say and is out of context, but he's an elitist. Country club elitist don't want anyone at the country club that didn't go to the same college as them. And it's part of that same elitism. And he's telling his girlfriend, stop hanging out with the players. It looks bad. You're hanging out with me. He's obviously jealous. And I think his comments are distasteful at a certain level. The issue is, though, what's she doing recording him? Where is it that rats are acceptable in this country where your girlfriend is recording you to then give it to the media? Because the religion is fighting racism when we all know the so-called minority groups are just as racist as anybody else, probably more so, because it's seen as popular. It's seen as acceptable. Listen to rap music. My God. I mean, it is off the chart attacking gays, women, uh, whites, you name it. But that's acceptable because it's cool. But I'm not defending it. The larger issue is they want him, Magic Johnson and others, to lose his franchise over his uh, Clippers. That's dangerous, folks, because then they're going to say, you said something, so you're going to lose your business. That's a First Amendment right. People want to boycott the Clippers, that's their issue. The players don't want to play tomorrow, that's their issue. But I think, his, I think what he said is elitist, and, and he can tell he's jealous, he knows she's going around with these guys, so that's really what it's about. But you know what, it was said in the privacy, so I just don't think it's admissible even in discussion. The real person here is this girlfriend recording him. And he's like, why, why are you so nice yesterday? You're so mean today. Because she's setting him up. And who knows how it's edited. And then you've got these authoritarian basketball players making $20 million a year on average, sometimes more, who want to run around. I, folks, I've been only a few times at NBA players' parties in Los Angeles. And, I mean, you want to talk about disconnected, out of control, arrogant, mean to everybody elitist. It's these guys. So I really don't think they have anything to say. I mean, it is like another world with the nouveau riche trash. I mean, a lot of people, people win the lottery, I don't care if they're black or white, they turn to trash. Well, these guys are a bunch of trash. All right, we'll be right back. Stay with us. Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure these sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee, and it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend, you will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great-tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. From the water table, to our soils, to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. And most Americans spend 90% of their time inside using toxic chemicals within their homes. There are more than 42 million smokers in the United States. Well over a thousand types of mold and mildew linked to numerous conditions. And don't forget the fact that six million Americans 
Americans live with pets they're allergic to as well. When I began to research these statistics, it was clear to me it was time to start cleansing my lungs in order to combat the toxic environment that we cannot escape but that we can fight back against. Made with organic and wild cultivated herbs and manufactured in the USA, the new InfoWars Life Lung Cleanse is here in a